Why haven't they been shaved? Well, I got him off Ted Dunstable. Just been letting things slip since his wife left. Still, it'll give you something to do, won't it? Dad, I don't know how to shear sheep. Well, you'll have to learn. Working hard, boys? Well, we've been up since five this morning. I know, sunshine. It was me who dragged you out of bed, remember? Bad news. Hannah found an old quad bike in one of the barns. Really? Oh, I've always fancied one of them. Forget it, you. Those things are death traps. I know if you don't know what you're doing. Oh, and since when have you been Lewis Hamilton? He wishes. <laughs> Besides, I can hardly ban Hannah from riding it and then let you two loose on it. Oh, she's a hard woman, you know, <laughs> isn't she? Well, tell me about it. Well, you should be nice to me, because I have my bacon back to you. Oh, mm. give us one of them. Get up, he's <laughs> coming back. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, spicy noodles. You do know we've got a bathroom. Oh, we need more hair conditioner. Hair conditioner? Why do you think they give you this Benz in the first place? Oh, so if we're paying for our own things, shall I cross off your designer body spray? Don't forget the toffee yogurt. Oh, I'm not eating that rubbish. You're not meant to. Oh, you know, the weekly shop was so much easier when I didn't have to consult you lot. I've just been summoned by Nathan Wilde. Why? Don't know, he didn't say he wants to see me tomorrow. Wine gums. Whack him down. Yeah, you did pay the rent. <laughs> yeah, of course I did. He probably just wants my advice on something. So I don't suppose anyone's going to volunteer to come with me? I've got guitar practice. Um, Megan's coming round to check out the farm. Mm -hmm. Is she? Well, like, that isn't why you're making yourself look presentable. Sure. It's it's... So it's me on my own around the supermarket again, is it? You're just an idle bunch of good-for-nothings, a lot of you. Oh, well, at least I've still got you for company. <laughs> oh, I'd only get in the way, love, wouldn't I? <laughs> How can you go shopping and forget to get anything for tea? Leave her alone. I think you're marvellous for a woman of your age. Yeah. <laughs> the tea's before bedtime if you lot aren't careful. Hello again. Hiya. Do you know him? New tenants up at Butler's. Are you stopping? Maybe not. Is he all right? I think so. Yesterday was a bit of a watershed for him. Well, oh, can't be easy. Find your old house for new people. It made him realise it's time to move on. What can I get you? Two pints, two shandies. Three. Two shandies and an orange juice and a menu, please. Douglas Potts. I run the farm shop at the bottom of the road. Delicacies to suit all palates. <laughs> <laughs> Just ignore him. He doesn't get out much, do you? <laughs> Are you settling in? We're still deciding who gets which room. Oh, she never lets go, does she? Mm, it'll be perfect once we've decorated. Yeah, seems OK to me. Yes, but you have no idea about interior design. And you do? When I was a kid, she put in my room mauve. Indigo? And you never complained at the time? Only because I was too young to answer back. Those days are long <laughs> gone, I take it. Oh, a very distant memory. I'm, uh, Adam, by the way. Are you indeed? He's a fascinating, isn't he? 